the plan today is to go out and we're going to do something quite unusual. We're going to actually take her out to this farm where she's agreed to show us where she's concealed these items. If Katrina Walsh leads detectives to the murder weapon, it could prove damning against both her and Sarah Williams. Here, somewhere where I can get to the water, and it'll be pushed into the mud somewhere down there, I think. Zapper, some odd oddments, a car key under those, under those. Awesome. You pointed then and you said knife. Show me where you pointed to. So where this horse, horse poo, poo is, because I've put the horse poo on top right. so, so that I could. Right. Then you said to me, zapper. Where's the zapper? In the under under, under some, this horse uh, uh, poo some, here. somewhere in that. Okay, so where did you go next? After doing that I went up to the yard where the Right, well come on, you yeah. show us, we will follow it back up. Yep, follow it back up. She's said on her walk round, she's pointed to places where she's put things. So uh, there's the knife and the taser. She's explained that she's pushed into the ground on the bank. Actually, be the car key. Yeah, I'm thinking that. We find what initially looks like pepper spray with something underneath it. Is there a bar missing, Chris? Yes, yes, there is. Yes, nice one. That's the same one that's on my head. There was at the scene a, a barb that was recovered, we believe, from a stun gun. Uh, we've just recovered a stun gun as well, missing uh, a barb. So there's just the one barb on there where there should be two. We've also recovered a car key, uh, which we believe is of interest to the inquiry team as well. <laughs> 